Where are we? Why, you're in the Rue. I'm Billy, the warden of the Rue. I'm an axolotl. Eating you two ugly morsels would barely be considered a snack in these parts. What have you done with Marcia? Who in the Hades is Marcia? Our owner! She rescued us and loves us, especially me. <laughs> no one is going to rescue you. There's only one way out of the room, and it's not for a couple of gutless, selfish pugs. Gutless? Would a gutless pug bark at the bathtub for two hours to scare away tob monsters? The only way out of the room is to find the wishbone. Sounds easy. Where is it? Oh, it is. It's just through here. Good luck, pugs. <laughs> hey, guys, check it out. Somebody thinks we're being too loud. Roll out the definator! Hey, pipe down! You're scaring my eye. And also mildly irritating me. Hey, can your voices grow? Your looks are shrinking them. <laughs> You're embarrassing yourself, Glenn. Why were you guys being so loud and scary? Duh, it makes us feel big. But we're pretty powerless if openly confronted about it. Hey, pal, save it for your diary. Tell us where the wishbone is, or we'll mop the floor with you. In the deep, dark woods, in her house of lies, is a map that will lead you to your prize. I think he means the wishbone. Who's House of Lies? The witch! He's wrong. The witch will try to fool you. Don't be fooled. Take this for protection. Also, what makes a cool noise. And, uh, please don't share how easily we back down. We don't want to lose our monster cred, you know what I mean? Your secret shame is safe with us. If we're getting all real dudes, scaring people is kind of lame. I see that now. Okay, thanks, bye! I miss them already. Billy? Boo. Ah. What? This guy looks like he could use a drink. Edgar, you shouldn't pee on things that aren't yours. But that's how I make it mine. Off the leaf, onto the branch, into the sinister looking hollow. <laughs> ah! Maya! Delicious. I believe I'll have seconds. Watch it. You almost stole Sweet Mary's blade with your skull. A beaver? Go ahead. I know I'm hideous. Have a good long laugh at my monstrously non buck tooth smile. Please, you have to help my friend. A giant ugly tree ate him. I bet I know just the one. Let's go. That there vampire tree has sucked all the nutrients from this once rich soil, killing every other tree. Now it eats up any poor soul that crosses its path. Well, 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 if it isn't my old nemesis. Pretty Teeth McGee. Yeah, keep joking about my chompers. Now that I finally caught you in the act, me and Sweet Mary are gonna turn you into a pile of toothpicks. <laughs> hey, Maya. What's going on? Edgar, you've got to get out of that trunk. The lumberjack is going to cut it all to pieces. I always assumed I'd be murdered by an axe-wielding maniac, but not on accident. Mr. Lumberjack, sir, you got to stop! My friend is in that vampire tree! A lot of people's friends are in this vampire tree, honey. Ha 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 ha! 
I vow on Sweet Mary not to stop chopping until he falls down dead. Oh, this is so gross. Ew, 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 ew. Even grosser. No, my princely locks! Excuse us. The kid bee said a witch named Idzrim lives near here. She's supposed to have a map for us. <laughs> Her magic is undone. We're free! Such a shame, Azram. I always liked your style. <gasps> I wish I was Marzia's pet. What the rough? I don't smell Marzia. <laughs> Uh-oh. Ted Evans voiceover, the voice you deserve right now. Please hire me.